Okay, back to here. Since this camera actually can record video uh, in uh, horizontal and also vertical format, ah, then I was interested to actually find out whether this actually files support as a, in a software from Sony called Sony Catalyst Browse. What it does is that it actually can improve the stabilization of the video in the software, but it will crop about, depending on how much you want to crop in the video. Before that, you actually need to download the software from the website. It's free for everyone to use. Download it, install to computer. Okay, then you import the file into the software and you will see that there's a stabilization icon. Ah, if it, if it shows that, means you can stabilize. If it doesn't show, means the camera doesn't store any of this kind of metadata. So press on it, you go to the stabilization and then usually you will automatically crop, super crop in. Ah, all you need to do is just press the manual and you just press about 90%. That's what I normally do. So I crop the frame about 10% to do the stabilization. So it's going to give you much better uh, video stabilization compared to, let's say you can see start from a, without any stabilization, just using the camera only, handheld, that's it. You can see how the video moving. Ah, then additionally is, next is, I'm just going to use the sensor stabilization. So same thing with a handheld, I'm also working at the same time, so you can see how the movement goes. Ah, okay, then last is with this Catalyst Browse. Ah, so you can see with this Catalyst Browse, it's even better in terms of the stabilizations. So it's all added benefit with this particular software right there. And only certain camera can support this metadata, unfortunately.